Uh, were there any Christine hate pages that you have seen? Hate pages. So, have you ever come across a, a hate page? <laughs> like I, I just kind of said, everything's been extremely positive ever since the beginning. But there was this one account that is so funny to me. It, it was recent in like the past six months, maybe. Yeah. Um, it was an account about how Sophia and I weren't real friends. <laughs> I remember. This. Yeah. So I forget the account name. I'm pretty sure they've deleted it after yeah. by now. But it was like Christine and Sophia Hater or something. Yeah. And and the bio was Christine and Sof or simply illogical and Sophia's friendship is fake AF. <laughs> so I saw it because other fan accounts were tweeting it or sharing it at me and like yeah. a lot of them were telling me about how bad this how person terrible. was so i was like what the heck's going on so i go and look at it and i'm like oh my god there is an account about how me and sophia aren't real friends and they're like documenting things and trying to uh, explain why we weren't real friends in this shoot or this video so i screenshotted it and sent it to sophia oh yeah and i said bitch what the fuck <laughs> we were exposed yeah so she laughed i laughed and it didn't hurt me at all. Like, I, I actually spent a good few minutes laughing <laughs> at the fact that this exists. It's pretty strange that someone may have made yeah. it. I mean, it's probably just some kid I somewhere. Know. Yeah, yeah. It is pretty funny that other people, like, came to your defense, though, to tell them that that was bad or wrong or whatever. Yeah, and I, I appreciate that, but I also just want people out there, like, whenever you're trying to defend me for something, especially like this, which I don't think is actually harmful, you kind of need to understand where that person is coming from maybe they're really bored or upset about other things in their life and i would just encourage people to not be mean you know when they're trying yeah. to tell others like don't do that you're hurting christian's feelings like thank you for caring about me but my feelings weren't, weren't hurt. hurt like i'm fine i laughed <laughs> and i just hope that whoever made that account finds some inner peace you know <laughs> or finds or finds people that they love and makes accounts about them instead yeah, like there are other creators who I think have a lot of hate accounts. Mm -hmm. And just the idea of making an account to express your dislike of someone, like people aren't above criticism and even specifically the criticism of YouTubers pretending to be friends for views, yeah. that totally happens. So I'm totally open to someone making that criticism if they suspect it's happening. It's not the case with you and Saf, but yeah. But like the idea of making accounts dedicated to disliking people online just seems like a kind of pretty sad thing to me. Yeah, and I think so too. And like I've said, I'm fortunate to not really see that about myself, but I have seen that about other influencers. Mm -hmm. And it's really sad. And like you just said, it doesn't mean that no one should criticize an influencer because maybe they made mistakes and there is some merit to the criticism or the discourse about what they did and um, you know, what they need to do to make it right, let's say. Mm. But making whole accounts and like novels and stories about all these people just seems like a misplaced use of energy, I think. And so I would encourage people to use, you know, your platforms or make accounts about stuff that you want to put your energy towards, that stuff that's positive and good and is going to have a good impact in your life. Because I just can't believe that... Um, making hate accounts about people is what is making you happy yeah like maybe you feel a temporary sense of like hey, 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 gotcha or like revenge in some weird way even though you've probably never per never met the person you're making this account about and, and mm -hmm. never will in your life um but that's not a real meaningful positive thing to have in your life in the long term yeah totally agree <laughs>